Here comes the raptor! Okay, looks like we're good to go. Whoa, Park Ranger! Ooh, Park Ranger will be me with Torm, man. You're all like out of breath there and everything. There's a raptor outside and it was chasing me and I barely even got away and... Yeah! Wow, that's a good thing you got away, man. You know, all these raptors and T-Rex running around. Ever since the Dynamaster left, the raptors and the T-Rex took down our paddock fences. A little bit of my help yeah. there. Man, it's just been complete chaos around here, hasn't yeah. it? Hey, what are you doing? I was just checking our supplies to make sure we'll be good to hang out here at T-Rex Ranch while that virus is out there everywhere. What do you mean? So there's this germ that's out there and it causes some people to get really sick. So we gotta make sure we don't catch it because we don't wanna risk giving it to the dinosaurs. That could be really bad. What? And they've even closed dino school. What? Just to make sure everybody stays safe. Oh, yeah. And doctors are asking everybody to stay home so they don't catch it or Ooh. spread it. Okay. So, how long are we gonna be cooped up in Dino HQ? Well, we really don't know yet how long we're gonna be here because there's all these scientists, they're doing research to try to beat this bug. But it could be a little while, so we just gotta hang out here, I guess. Oh, yeah. So, what can we do to prevent getting it? Well, now that you mention it, there are a couple of really important things we can do, like using the proper sneeze and cough procedure. What? I bet you didn't even know there was a procedure for sneezing and coughing, did you? Oh, no. Okay, it goes like this. One, two, three. <laughs> Like that, huh? Okay, let me try. <laughs> yeah, that's it, perfect. Just like that, man. Okay, yeah. you can go right, you got that one down. And then the other thing you can do is make sure you wash your hands often and for 20 seconds. Ooh, 20 seconds. Yeah, you're gonna turn on the water, do a little soap, and count to 20. Or you can just sing the happy birthday song twice, okay? Oh. Happy birthday to you. Nah, happy nah, birthday nah, to nah, you. Nah, 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 nah. Happy birthday. Nah, nah, nah. what, what? What's wrong with that? I man? got a Way better idea. You got a better idea. What are we gonna do? How about we have to do dinosaur stuff? So let's sing the T Rex Ranch song. Oh yeah, I bet part of that'll be 20 seconds. Yeah. Okay, here, why don't you come over here and wash your hands? Okay. I'll time you, okay? All right, on your mark, set, go. T Rex Ranch is the place I wanna be. All the creatures running free. Come join me! T Rex Ranch has a mighty dino roar from our favorite dinosaur. Come join me! Ha ha ha! Now you're getting it. Ha ha ha! Come join me! Ha ha ha! Come join me! Hey! That was right at 20 seconds there. Yeah! Okay, there you go. All right. So, now you know how to practice good hygiene, okay? Yeah! Okay, man, let's go sit down over here and figure out what to do. Yeah. All right. That was good work, practicing good hygiene there, okay? Yeah, but what if we still get sick? You know, it could happen, I guess, but the doctors are saying that most people who catch it don't get very sick, okay? Oh, okay. And they're gonna be fine, but you know what? We gotta be careful because older people can get really sick. Which means we gotta watch out for the dinosaurs because they're like 65 million years old. That's really old, okay? Whoa. We don't want them to get sick now, okay? Yeah. Right, so let's just keep washing our hands okay. and yeah. we'll be good, okay? Yeah. okay? Important thing though is not to panic. Yeah. So what are we gonna do? That's a good question. I hadn't really thought that far ahead. Let's see. Ooh, I know. Got an idea here. Let's go check it out over here. Check this out right here. We're gonna use this right there. Hey. Okay, got a little bag there, okay? And then you need these shish kebab sticks right here. What? Yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay, some, real hot dogs or something? No, 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 okay. And then pick a color here, one of these food colorings there, okay? Hmm. Great. Great, okay, ha. put that back. Okay, that'll work. Hmm. Let's what go try this doing? experiment, huh? Oh, okay, let's go. We're gonna need some water for this experiment. Water. So let's use this water hose right over here, okay? Okay. Yeah, there we go, right there. Watch out with that thing, oh. man. Okay, wait, yeah, oh yeah, we gotta put the water in the bag, okay? All right, here we go. Ah! 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 Go. Okay, that's good, I think. Now, you got the food coloring there, huh? Yep. Just keep turning it. Be careful. That stuff will stain. Yeah. All right, here. Put about two drops in there. All right, there we go. Okay. Ooh, now. Great. Ooh, yeah, there we go. It looks like grape juice now, doesn't it? Huh. But you got to shake it up, okay? There we go. There we go. Okay. All right. 
Okay. You ready for this? Yeah, what are you gonna do? I am going to put this stick through this bag. No! And it's, it's not it. going to leak. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Watch this. Here we go. Upward angle there. There we go. There we go. <laughs> there. Look at that. Okay, you got one more left here. All right. Uh, oh, wait. Now you're up in the atmosphere there. Okay. <laughs> the atmosphere. Okay, yeah. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Oh, huh? So cool. Okay. You want to know why it doesn't leak? Why? Because this bag is made out of what's called a polymer. Okay? That's what this plastic is. It's like molecules that are all connected together in a long chain. It kind of looks like spaghetti if you could actually see it. It'd be like a whole bunch of spaghetti, and then you put the sticks in between all the spaghetti like that, okay? Oh, like yeah. that. And it makes a seal around it so it doesn't leak. Oh, yeah. The problem is we made a hole. So when we pull it out, watch what happens. Let's go over here. I don't want to put this on the patio. Here. What do you mean? All right, you want to pull one of those bad boys yeah. out? Okay. What? Uh, yeah, the water's coming out now because, whoa, whoa. there you go. <laughs> That's because you left a hole between the spaghetti. The last one. <laughs> whoa. whoa, there we go. All right, that's a pretty cool experiment, isn't it? Huh? Yeah, but for some reason it's making me hungry. Hungry? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about that. I got it taken care of there in the pantry in the kitchen. Ooh. Let's take this inside and go have some okay, food. Let's go. Good, good, good. All right, check this out. Looky here, whole pantry full of beans right there, okay? We're gonna have all the beans we need to wait this thing out here at T-Rex oh, Ranch, okay? Oh no, this is gonna be stinky time at T-Rex Ranch. Yeah, I guess it could be a stinky time. <gasps> hey, look, it's tiny. Tiny? The baby Apatosaurus. Yeah. I forgot to feed the baby dinosaurs today. Oh. Okay. You know what, this could be a problem feeding them while this is all going on. Yeah. We better get outside and come up with a plan, okay? Come okay. on, let's go. All right, Park Ranger will be. Let's go feed these baby dinosaurs. Let's take go. Care of here, okay? Wait a minute. What, 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 what? I thought we weren't supposed to go near the dinosaurs because we might give them the germ. Yeah, you're right. That could be bad. If I, I don't think we've got the germ, but you're right. We don't want to give it to them. So you know what we do? What? We stay six feet away from them, okay? Oh. This is like from one tip of my fingers to the other tip. That's about six feet. So you yeah. need to keep your distance from the babies when you're feeding them, and then that way, they, even if we did have it, they won't catch it then, yeah. okay? Wait, that would make feeding a lot harder. Oh yeah, you're right. It's gonna make feeding them pretty hard. Yeah. We can't get up close to the dinosaurs yeah. to feed them. Ah. So you gotta do this, you gotta plan. Plan, you plan. I got an idea! What? How about we feed the baby dinosaurs here? Oh, here in the Dino garage? Dino HQ, yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, I know. We'll take these buckets here. They oh, have the feed yeah. in them. And we'll just put these over here, mm. like that. We'll make like a feeding station. Like then come right up. Here, we're just buckets. There we go. Here okay. We go. Dino Depot hey. buckets. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What? How are we going to get them to come back to Dino HQ? Oh, haven't really thought of that yet. Oh, here we go, here we go. Yeah. Hey, looky here. Ooh. These are the dino lures we've been working on. Wow. We'll go out, and I, you know how they love to respond to shiny things. Yeah. Okay, let's go out. We'll see if we can lure them back, okay? Yeah, right, let's go. Let's go. See any dinosaurs anywhere? Mm -hmm. Whoa! Oh, man, Just watch out. Man. With it. Okay. I think there's a thunderstorm coming. We better hurry up and find these babies. Uh oh. Huh. The fork in the road, huh? What we do now, huh? What do you think? Oh, 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 oh. That storm's getting close. Yeah. We better hurry up and find these babies and lure them back to Dino HQ before the storm gets here. Yeah. We'll never find uh, them after the rain. Okay, what are we doing? Here? There's only one thing we can do. What? You have to go that way, and I have to go that way. Okay, well, let's see if you can find a baby dinosaur. Here we go. Okay. Let's get ready. Okay, baby dinosaur. Come here. 
Come here. You know you're out here. Look, it's a raptor! Oh, I'm on a raptor. Oh yeah, I know you want it, yeah. We gotta get you inside and feed you before the storm gets here. Ooh, yeah, see, it's almost here. Any second now, okay? It's gonna start raining hard. Look, <laughs> it's a baby triceratops. Okay, baby triceratops. A raptor. Raptor, oh, look what I got here. That you want your little toy, huh? Yeah, no, no, over here. Oh, yeah, you... Come on, you know, you want to follow me back to Dino HQ, okay? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah, 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 come on. No, yeah. Don't, don't lose, don't lose attention on the little shiny thing there, okay? Come on, Triceratops. Let's go. You're going fast! <laughs> oh, oh, come on, stay with me, Triceratops. Come on, Raptor! Whoa! <gasps> Quick, hide, 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 hide. They're coming, they're coming. Okay. okay. Here they come. Oh, yeah, they're coming. Here they are. Yeah, it's working. It did. Yeah. Close the garage door. Yeah, they're in. Okay, I'll get the garage door. Ranger Asher, come check it out. I found this trunk in a basement filled with all these interesting knickknacks. Like this old dusty notebook. <coughs> <coughs> Too bad there's no way we would ever know who it would belong to. This notebook belongs to Park Ranger Andy. Oh, wait, Park Ranger Andy? But that's me. I don't remember ever owning that notebook or any of this stuff. <gasps> I bet it belonged to the very first T-Rex Ranch Park Ranger! My great, great, great grandpa Andy! Wow, he must have been pretty great. Yeah, it was okay. Oh, look, he wrote a letter to future park rangers. <gasps> That's us! Dear future park rangers, I am writing from the year 1862, where I have just buried what I am calling a time castle. Somewhere in T-Rex Ranch, this time capsule contains one very important item that can only be used by park rangers. In order to find it, I have devised what I am calling a scavenger hunt with clues that will lead you to the capsule and all the wonder contained therein. Good luck and happy hunting. Wow, 1862, that's almost... A hundred and sixty years ago. A hundred and sixty years? That's almost a million! Hmm. I wonder if the time capsule's still there. Well, there is only one way to find out. Scavenger hunt! hunt. Backpacks? Shit. Shovels? Shit. Dino freeze ray? Uh, dino freeze ray? But we're just going on a full little scavenger hunt, no? Well, I'd rather be safe than sorry. Good point. Go to the place where the winged dinos sleep and try not to make a peep. Hmm. Most dinos weren't classified back in Grandpa Annie's age. Tyrannodon? Maybe. Or the Tannosaurids. Their name means winged lizard. That's some good thing, in Park Ranger. I hope I'm as smart as you when I grow up. Now let's go find us a time capsule. Wait! You need to drive. Oh, okay. You say so. Well, looks like we found a Patinosaurus. This is this is this. So, now what? I mean, if only we had some kind of marker! Oh, well, what do you know? It's time to start digging. Oh, I found something already. Oh, this is good. Oh, got it. 
Oh, this is pretty simple. Look at it. I think I got something. <sighs> oh, yeah. Oh. Pieces here. Oh, wow. Don't make me beg. Go to the place where the spiny lizards lay their eggs. Well, we know what that means. Oh, yeah. Yeah, of course we do. You don't know, do you? I do, I do. Spikes are but spikes. Gardens. <laughs> Let's just go. I knew it. I think you mean X marks the spot. Uh, that's what I said. Just be careful, because if a Spinosaurus sees us, we're goners. So we're going to have to move very slowly. Very slowly. Got it. Okay, not that slowly. Okay. Ah! Oh! 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 Yeah! Oh! Yeah! I think I found something. Nice work, Fun Danger. Oh! Faster! Oh! 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 Let's start reading more writing! Are you sure you read the third clue correctly? Go where the running lizards hunt for food and hope against hope that they're in a good mood. That's our lab term, right? But what do we do now? I don't know. Great, great, great Grandpa Andy was great at many things, but my includes was not one of them. <gasps> Wait a minute. Look, where the raptors were. There it is! Grab the shovels. Ooh, here goes nothing. <laughs> uh, on second thought, why don't we just go back to Dino Headquarters where it's, you know, safe and quiet? I mean, after all, I don't need no dusty old time capsule, do you? Well, it's not about the time capsule anymore, because if we don't complete the mission, then who will? You know what? You're right. And when you're right, you're right. And you're always right. Right? Let's do it. Oh, things are looking up. Yeah. Ah, oh. <laughs> I got you now. Hey, where you going? <laughs> oh. Told ya. Huh. You did good, Park Ranger. You did good. Here we go. What to do? The time capsule is located 200 paces beyond Dino HQ. Oh, are you kidding? After everything we went through today, it was right behind Dino headquarters the entire time? Oh. I'm beginning to think your great, great, great grandpa wasn't all that great. You could say that again. After all, how many times today were we put in hands away? I think it's harm's way. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's ham's way. After all, pigs are very brave. What? 
196, 197, 198, 199, 200. Shovel, please. <laughs> dig, dig, faster. Dig, dig, keep digging. <gasps> Found it. Help me, help me. Oh. oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, what'd we find? What'd we find? It looks like a dino remote control. What would it do? 1862, present day. <gasps> I think it's a time machine. Wait a minute. What if it's not? What if it's something really, really bad, like something that drops a brachiosaurus down from the sky on us or something? This is a time machine. Huh. Nope. Well, proceed. Okay, here we go. <gasps> Go diggity, where am I? Oh, hello, handsome. You look awfully familiar. Well, I should. I'm your great, great, great grandson, Andy. And this is my associate, Park Ranger Asher. A pleasure to meet you. That must mean you discovered my time machine. He sure did. Oh, well, I'm glad to see that it still works. May I take a look, see? <gasps> Not bad for an antique, eh? I built this time machine in order to bring dinosaurs from the past and study them in our present. And that is how T-Rex Ranch began. We had no idea. But we have so much to talk about. Yeah, and you should come see all the new gadgets we've invented. I would be delighted. Uh, uh, I'm going to take what I'd like to call a rain check. Gotta go. They left us with all kinds of questions. Aww. You know what? He left me with a brand new hat, too. A brand new old hat. How'd you look? Oh! <laughs> By Jimmy Jank! That was close. Oh! <laughs> Aren't you bored, Max? No. <laughs> Why would I be? I mean, every day we patrol T-Rex Ranch. Check on the plant eaters. Whoa. Oh. They're just doing their vegetarian thing. I still wouldn't want to get between that guy and a veggie burger, which is cool. It's just, I want some adventure, Max. This is T-Rex Ranch after all, but the big guys are far away, behind a boring electric fence. I don't know if I could promise an adventure, but there's something I've never seen before. It's beautiful. What is it? I'd say it's a dinosaur egg, but it doesn't look like any dino egg I've seen. Max, you don't know what's going on. Um, probably in the dinosaur's butt? You have no idea where dino eggs come from, do you? Correct! But if it is a dino egg, where's the nest? Max, what did I just say? I don't know. Obviously, I wasn't listening. Oh, jeez, Kabob! What do we do, Bella? Screaming now, but quiet. Why is he chasing us? Maybe because I took his egg? Or her egg? Why didn't you leave it on like they told you? Because I'm a bad listener. We've covered this. <gasps> Roar! A T-Rex just scared the pants off you! Go back three spaces and retrieve your pants. That would never happen. You know I'm a belt man. 
All right, Park Ranger Asher. Let's see how well you can evade the T-Rex sniffer, hmm? Yes! Ha! Easy! You don't have any blasters or stun rays? No, T-Rex is not supposed to be in this part of the ranch. Wait, I do have something. Asher's new personal assistant app. You who, Arexa? Hello, Park Ranger Bella. How can I help you? First of all, keep your voice down. Copy that. Thank you. Arexa, I need you to send an SOS call to any park rangers nearby. Tell them we're in danger. Issuing a distress call now. She's not going to hurt you if you have the egg. Just walk backwards with the egg facing out. T-Rex trouble. We did it too, see? What is that? I'm so glad you asked. Starting something new here at T-Rex Ranch called the Park Ranger Achievement Program. Whenever you acquire new skills or complete tasks, you can receive a Park Ranger Achievement Badge for your vest. Yeah, and I just earned my very first badge from T-Rex Trouble. Great, but... Therefore, with the power vested in me as Senior Park Ranger, I hereby give you, Park Ranger Asher, the Board Game Boss Badge. Uh, so what is this, iron on? You have to sew it. I don't know how to sew. Well, we know what your second badge is gonna be, huh? Doesn't anybody want to know what just happened to us? No, oh, okay, yes, yes, sorry. Yes, sorry. sorry, sorry. Go ahead, sorry. go on, Max. Max found this dino egg, and then a T-Rex tried to take it from us. It looks like one of those surprise eggs with toys and confetti inside it. Mm, not a fan. I don't like surprises. I like knowing exactly what's inside my eggs. The yolks mostly. My guess is a T-Rex egg, for obvious reasons. But we may have a bigger problem on our hands. Mama T-Rex got over the electric fence and snuck into Herbivore Valley. You know what that means. It's, it's time. time. This is our secret gadget closet. Everything in here was invented by a former park ranger who we used to call the Dino Master. He was a brilliant inventor, but thought he could control and manipulate the dinosaurs instead of help keep them safe like we do now. So, we asked him to leave. Mm, didn't go so well. He vowed revenge. Cursed both our houses. Very dramatic. Oscar winning. But he did invent something that may help our surprise egg. 
A dino egg incubator. It'll do the job of the mama and then some. Park Ranger Maisie, will you do the honors? What do you do? Asher, come on. This is a really fun game, Asher. Yeah, thanks. I stepped in Dino Poop again, and I lost my turn. In real life, when I step in Dino Poop, I just lose my shoes. Wow, I've lost so many shoes. Ah! Park Ranger Awesome! Maisie, miss me. No. Oh, my feelings are hurt. Don't pretend like you don't remember your old friend. The Dino Master. Huh. I love what you've done with the police. Especially my old incubator. Huh. And I see there's a new prize inside. I'd love to know more. Not so fast, Dino Master. You get a bite of Orson's big boot. Is he gone? That's pretty creepy. Is that enough adventure for you? <laughs> Now that that's done, let's see if Park Ranger Matt can get his foot out of the duty. Forty three minutes earlier. Hope you're staying out of trouble. I got some egg watching to do. Now, why won't you hatch? Can I help you, Park Ranger Asher? Yeah, I was hoping to borrow one of your books. Oh, that's great. I'm so excited you're showing an interest in reading. Let's see. We've got a modern history of paleontology. Can you dig it? Tales of a fossil hunter. Oh, that's clever. It doesn't really matter. I just need them to walk over the lava. Walk over the what now? You've got to be kidding me. Hey, Park Ranger Bella, come take a look at this. On my way. Be careful of the lava. I'll take my chances. Does that look like a crack to you? I'm not sure. Think it's a dud? Could be. Or a dino master trick. Oh, I wish there was some way to find out. Why don't you call him and ask? Are you staring at me because I'm on the table or because of what I said? Both. Although... You're not thinking. I am. What would Park Ranger Orson say? Probably something like... I wouldn't trust the Dino Master as far as I can throw him. That's a good impression. Thanks. But we shouldn't bother Orson while he's on vacation. I bet he's having the time of his life. This is boring. Or not. Hard to say with him. We're all in agreement that calling the Dynamaster is a ridiculous idea. Right. Right. 
I mean, how would we even get a hold of him? Easy, like this. Yoo hoo, Arexa. Yes, Park Ranger Asher. How can I help you today? Call the Dino Master. We want to ask him a question. Calling the Dino Master now. I'm sorry. New phone. Who this? Oh, Park Rangers. Did you mean to call me? Actually, we did. Don't worry. This is weird for us, too. Well, I'm extremely annoyed that you called. What do you want? Our golden dino egg isn't hatching, and we're wondering if there's actually a baby dino inside, or... Or if it's one of your tricks again. No, not one of my tricks, I'm afraid. But, and I know you want to believe me, legend has it if you place an egg at the center of the mystical dino spiral, you... Actually, can you hold? What's he doing? Hello, this is the Dino Master. Still us. Oh, sorry about that. Where was I? Oh, yes. If you place an egg at the center of the mystical dino spiral, a full-grown dinosaur will appear inside the egg. Sounds easy enough. See, you say that, but first you must complete three trials. Cross the lake of fire, bow to the Patinosaurus Guardian, and win a staring contest with the Stegosaurus. Come on. We don't believe you, Dino Master. Fine. Go see for yourself. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? <laughs> I don't like the sound of that laugh. It's the laugh I was born with. Listen, you called me! Got it. I think I know the place he's talking about. There's a clearing just north of the Titanosaurus jump, big enough to hide a spiral rock formation. This is definitely the craziest thing we've ever done. Yeah. <sighs> okay, park rangers, let's take our unhatched egg on a field trip to the mystical dino spiral. Hey, Park Rangers. This is Park Ranger Orson. Well, I guess I'm not officially on duty, so I guess you could call me... On second thought, I still want you to call me Park Ranger Orson. Hey, I thought you were on vacation. I am, but I just wanted to check in and see how things were going. Why? What have you heard? Sorry, uh, what was that? To be honest, I'm, uh, pretty bored. So bored, in fact, I was thinking of calling up the Dino Master for a little excitement. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine how ridiculous? <laughs> that is ridiculous. Well, I'll leave you guys to it. Bark Ranger Orson, over and out. I know, I know, but I can't tell them I'm spending my vacation in T-Rex Ranch. They'll think I'm crazy. Want some? I hope we're doing the right thing. Back soon, babies. Asher, you coming? Yeah. Do I need my backpack? Nah, I got mine. Let's go. Okay. You can't be too careful about the lava. This is the Raptor River, but it's been dry a long time. Not much of a fiery lake, if you ask me. Wait, it's a Patinosaurus. Is he guarding the path? Doesn't look like it. Maybe we can just ease on by. The Dino Master said to bow.
How about a curtsy? Bow it is then. No way we're getting past that guy. <gasps> it's the Stegosaurus staring contest! Leave it to me. I was the staring contest champion of my high school. Eyeballs might have dried out. Whoa! I can't believe the dino spiral was real. I can't believe the dino master was telling the truth. Yeah, about everything but the lake of fire, apparently. Mm, technically, it's not a spiral, it's more like a maze. Let's go! I feel silly doing this. There's no way the adult version of the dino and the egg is going to show up when we put the egg in the center of the spiral. There's just no scientific basis. Eh, at least we're having some quality time together. I knew it. It's another one of Dino Master's tricks. Wait! <gasps> See? It worked. Hang on. Just because a Triceratops happened to show up doesn't mean that there's a baby Triceratops inside the egg. Judge the Dino Master. Still, it's kind of creepy. Let's get our new baby tribe back to the Dino HQ. <sighs> we'll be home soon, little one. Let's go this way. You gotta walk out the same way you walk in. That's just good Dino Spiral manners. Yeah, that makes sense. Continued. <laughs> 